Hi everyone and welcome back to the channel. Benny don't cry see Marcus here again with another great video. Starting off here in the beautiful Alche Park. God, I love this gimbal. Oh, I can just sort of like tap on my face and it tracks me. So I can sort of show you round wets in the background. The statue as you come into I'll try behind me as well. Absolutely gorgeous. Flip your arm, let's get on with the adventure. Got the beautiful scooter Sue with us. Say hi Sue. Hi Sue. Typical. And of course, what makes Alche Park, Alche Park? All the doves. The doves. Absolute beautiful, aren't they guys? I will try track some, see if I can. Yep, there we are. I think I'm tracking man. I don't know. <laughs> no, I don't really work on tubs, but yeah. So of course there's the water fountain for them so they can have a drink. And they are quite cute. I'm trying to not get one on camera so I can sort of track him. Don't really work. Ah, there we go. And now I've lost him. They are so gorgeous, guys. Okay, going to, I think, head on this way. Yeah. So of course that's where you can that's where you can get the bird seat for them to feed them. And they are gentle guys, they are really gentle. And we're going to just take a walk through our chai park, which does of course run along Ponyanto Beach. Sort of runs along next to the beach. So that's what makes it even better. <coughs> and well, it is quite a popular area just to come and maybe have a picnic, maybe just sit and chill, read a book or something. Um, well, you do of course have sort of shaded areas as well under the palm trees and sort of set back a bit off on the road. You got bars, the yellow submarine, or up on that sort of side road there. You got more restaurants, gusto, the reef your bar. Places like that, if you are looking for a spot to eat without being pestered by doves. <laughs> it's an absolute beautiful day here in Benidorm, guys. And of course, if you want to make the most of your holiday, the Sun Sand Fiesta, your ultimate Benidorm handbook, book is out now on my Buy Me A Coffee link. On the Buy Me A Coffee shop, guys. So make sure to go check it out. Or if you do just want to support the channel, help me to make much more brilliant content here in 
the sunkiss paradise that is banned on. Then I've got my buy me a coffee link directly down below. Cause there's Poniente Beach. Um, you know what? I think I will say it. My favourite Benidorm beach. Apart from the nudist beach when it's open, of course. <laughs> Little or a humour there for you. Probably not the best joke. I see that Perry just walked past all laughing at it. So I can't have been that bad. <sighs> um, some comparisons for Benidorm that I've seen used is um, it's kind of like Blackpool with the sun and when which sort of links it to Benidorm, I mean to Ibiza, is Ibiza is Benidorm on steroids. <laughs> Which, I mean, I can probably run and truly agree about that. Beach is also very accessible as well. As you can see, steps that side and the ramp sort of that side. If you're in a wheelchair or not, you've got a pram with you or something. And, of course, a kids play area as well, all throughout our show part. And the sort of best part coming up now. It's the outdoor gym. And you've got the board here on how Benny Dorma found it, I think. Yeah, you can't really see much of it because it's got sort of shadowed. And I think there's some more like comic like there for the kids to read. And of course, there's the outdoor gym. Some of the England did actually try, but um, yeah, I think it works a lot better here in sort of Spain. I, I think you'll probably find we have the sum for it. And we have the sort of better areas to put stuff where they won't get damaged or sort of destroyed. Got the zip line there as well for the kids. <laughs> and as we come to the end uh, of Chai Pot, you do pass the beautiful Hotel H10 Porto Poniente and I'm going to leave you with a little bit of a quiz question so guys in one of the latest videos I've done of course the, the colour finish that Benny Tom Open Top Tour Bus there are a bit of information on it. The Grand Hotel Bali is supposedly the biggest hotel in Europe. Yet, guys, the question is, how many floors does the Grand Hotel Bali actually have? Now, I think the way I'm going to do this is on my do the answer in the next video. So, no cheating and going on to Google to get the answer. <laughs> no cheating and going on to my 
earlier video we done about it to get the answer or going to the next video where I say the answer. I think Mum sat there trying to count the floors, aren't you? You're trying oh, to count how many? You've confused me. <laughs> I've confused her. Anyway, guys, smash that like, smash the subscribe, of course. Check out Scooter Sue's channel for Benny Dom on a scooter. Check out Benny Dom at Mike's channel and the Benny Dom Ball, which I do believe. He's going to try to do a few more sort of travel type videos on it. Smash the like, smash subscribe. Don't forget I've got my buy me a coffee link down below if you do want to support the channel. And I've got the Sun Sand and Fiesta, your ultimate Benny Dunman, but that's linked down below if you want to purchase it. <sighs> It's another day in the office. It's another day in paradise. See you soon.